What's up YouTube, Doswell Beats back with another video If this your first time to the channel, as always, welcome Please, don't forget to like, share, subscribe And hit that notification button to get notified whenever I drop some heat Alright, today, what I'm doing, I'm going in Using the generate random notes to make some cool melody If you're using the MPC software And you can't come up with a melody Generate some random notes and you know what I mean you can you can get some good sounding stuff all right so today that's what I'm gonna do I'm gonna go in and show you how to use the generator random notes and show you how to do it remember if you're watching this channel and you're not yet subscribed go ahead subscribe because most of my viewers is not subscribed to my channel yet all right so if this is you and you one of them just hit that subscribe button all right let's get it let's go Alright, so what we're going to do first, I'm going to show you how to set it up. If you have an MPC, you go to the, on the, the, where your track is at, you go to the track, hit the pencil icon on the track, and go to generate random events, okay? That's on the MPC, alright? If you don't have an MPC, and you're just using the MPC software by itself, you come up here, hit the hamburger menu go to tools and then go to generate random events right there you get the same thing see it alright but first before we do that let's go to our VST and let's open up um, expand All right, so let's bring up, let's bring up that, let's bring the generated notes back up. All right, so what we're going to do, we're going to leave it on um, melodic events, replace all event, but we're going to change that and put to add to existing event, right? What we're going to do, leave this on eight bars, but we're going to switch this to bar, because first we build in our, like our chord notes, right? Then we're going to put this on four. If I could get it to go on four. All right. So we want to do from C3 to C5. We're going to do G and put the to natural minor. Bring the, the um, density to 50. And then we're going to just hit apply click apply all right so that's the bar right so after we do that, now let's do uh, let's do one fourth, All right? One fourth. Take this down to like twenty. All right. Now we wanted to be in the same range. Now let's just hit apply. See what happens. Now we did our one fourth. Let's do um, our one eighth and bring this down a little bit. We is at 20. Let's bring it down to 10. If I can get it to 10. Let's bring it to 10. There we go. Then hit apply. Now let's hear what that sound like. I 
say we don't like that we just hit undo one time and then hit apply again give us a brand new sound let's go don't like that hit undo and let's take it off of four and let's put it on just one and then hit uh, apply let's hear what that sound like satisfied with that you just hit close once you hit close that's your, your 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 melody right there but you can go ahead and just move some stuff around if you want to so I see a note that I want to move around but let's go and listen to it one more time then I'll show you the note that I want to move around let's go Alright, so see this note right here? I want to move it because it's hitting too much. All of this is hitting too much one time. Alright? So, let's take this note right here and just hit over on the... One, two, three, four. That's it. Let's play. See what it sounds like now. it that's all you got to do to make your own creative sound the MPC went in there and made it for you made everything for me I didn't even have to do nothing just went into the um, generate random notes bang this sound decent what you could do there's a lot a lot of stuff you could do with this right now if you go to um, the pencil tool and then do the um, uh, double speed the event right listen the double speed then we'll just take some of the stuff out if we don't need it like this is too much this little one right here too much let's hear much so let's move them around one two then move this one two three four. this one we can duplicate duplicate this one and just move it over to the end Alright, so now what we do, control A, select all, hit control D, and now listen.
that's the melody right there all you need counter melody or or copy this note I mean copy these MIDI send it to another track put another um, instrument on it and have both instrument playing at the same time and you have a, a full sound alright see you in the next one don't forget to like share subscribe hit that notification button to get notified whenever I drop some heat alright YouTube let's get it